yep got a hat on in this video because I'm in between either cutting my hair or growing out and putting on a wig like I don't know what to do at the moment I feel like I want braids again in the future but how am I gonna have braids if my head's bald so it's a bit you know mix match my top lip is sweating I need to drink some water and I need to leave the house in about 10 minutes Gafunkles. Gafunkles? Gafuckles. What are they called? What are they called? What is the food that they serve? Frank and Benny's are the same. Let's get to it. Gafuckles. Okay? <laughs> who won it? Who, who won it? Which nigga little goon getting stewed with the onion? So, <sighs> I went to Gafunkles. Um, and I was thinking the other day, I was walking past it and I was thinking, I actually haven't even spoken about my experience when I went there. So, this needs to be put on the big wide web. And here I am today. So, went to Gafon Calls um, in Flepen Rarazet, in Oxford Street, yes. <laughs> in Oxford Street, the one that sets the five guys, if you know that strip, if you're about, if you're about it, about it, you know what I'm talking about. So, <laughs> excuse me, beg your pardon. So I went there and actually after this experience, they closed down. Now, this must be the reason why. I'm sure a lot of people complained. I went there. I went there with my boyfriend and we had a fry up. Now fry ups are very simple, very simple. I could do a fry up with my eyes closed. We, I think we were going to like Badlands or something. So I have never even been to Badlands with him. What am I ever talking about? We were going to somewhere, maybe Portsmouth or somewhere outside London. Cause I feel like every time I have a fry up, it's either an airport or I'm going somewhere. So it's like a start off with like something new. It feels alright when I'm here with you, yeah. So, um, also, if my hat looks like someone's been sitting on it, I'm sorry. Like, it is what it is. Let's just get to it. Ria, get to the point. Right, so we went to Kafunkos and we ordered a fry up. Fry up was cold. My thing is, how, how do you manage to make a fry up cold? Cold. The eggs were cold. My boyfriend asked for his eggs not to be runny because he's not a yolk man. <laughs> so he wanted them to be scrambled. They weren't scrambled, they were rambled. They were completely raw. Like, it, it's like the woman just cracked the egg on the plate and just left it out of order. So that was, that was bad. Then we ordered, it was, with it comes mushroom. Mushroom was burnt off the rafts. Like, it was finished. Finish him. It was so burnt that I didn't even know it was mushroom. That's how mad it is. The sausages were that big. Um, it was diabolical, to be honest. And then, just, I just, good shot for dinner. I rarely complain to managers. Like, usually, I just sit at home and I'm just, Ugh. I get so angry because food is life. Like, food is life. So I would usually just cuss with my boyfriend. We cuss like, it was a freaking trash place. But we won't do anything about it. But this day, I was like, no, you've basically ruined my morning. So let's have a little bit of a complaint. So I said, can I switch your manager, please? You know that? That authority, that author, that, that, the, the authorant talk. That's not even a word. Can I speak to your manager, please? So she brought over her manager. She was like, this is my manager. You know, she had a bit of an attitude before she brought the manager over because I was thinking, why are you riding or dying for fuckles? Like, why do you care? Why do you care? So she got her manager. I was like, yo, bro. No, I didn't say that. I said, hello, sir. My name's Ria. And I'm just, what is the matter with me today? I said, hi, we've ordered fry ups and they are trash. They are disgusting. They're, everything's cold, everything's raw. And he was like, oh, I'm sorry, madam, would you like to have one? I'm like, bro, it took you about an hour to bring them out. Fry up, you know, fry up. That takes about 10 minutes in the calf. This is why I love the calf, because you could just depend on the calf. You, could, you know that Aussie, because that's his name, you know that Aussie will whip it up quick and he will come and it will be fresh and it will be lovely and he will even come and have a conversation with you because, you know, it's with the culture. So when he said, do you want another one? I said, I'd rather die. Um, obviously I said that in my head and um, I was like, no, thank you. I want a refund. So he gave me a refund and he was like, oh, here's a 10% off next time. And I'm like, what makes you think that I'm coming back next time? Like, I'm actually thinking of ways to torch this place. Like... <laughs> It's trash. Frank and Benny's, is it, is it owned by Goffron Crawls as well? Because just as trash. Went to Frank and Benny's in Wembley. And um, my boyfriend didn't know what to order. So he was like, do you know what? You can't mess up a burger. <laughs> That's what he thought. He said, you can't mess up a burger. Let me get a burger. So he got a burger. Burger was burnt in the rass. It was burnt up. The whole thing was burnt, even the bun. It's like they got 
this is what I'm saying. It's like they got Rustler's Burger, yeah? Because I say this all the time. A lot of restaurants are... A lot of Rustler's... Restaurants. A lot of restaurants are doing Rustler's Burgers, yeah? They get doing Rustler's Burgers. They're getting Rustler's... Rustler's Burgers. And they're putting them on the stove. And they're burning them. And they're making you think that, Oh my God, it's barbecue. No, it's burnt. It's burnt. It's burnt. It's burnt. It's... Burnt. it's, it's I'm sorry, it's a mess. It's a mess. And it's like people, I think they think that we think that we're the shushy. I don't know if they think that we're not black and they can just be like, oh no, it's carnival. Like it's like carnival barbecue. It's not. It's burnt. It's burnt. She burned the whole burger. So we were like, we don't want to eat this. And she was like, is, is there a problem, ma'am? Can you not see on the plate that everything's charcoal color? Everything is finished. We don't want it. And the thing is, I don't even want a refund. I want you lot to be closed down. Like I actually want you to be closed down. People shouldn't be eating in these places. I don't understand how you can mess up a burger, a burger, a burger. Get the burger, put it in the bun. I don't understand what you know, eating out for me is an experience, okay? And if you're messing up the experience, you're messing up my, my, you're hurting my heart. One time I went to Frank and Benny's for a birthday. This is before they charcoaled the hell out of the burger. And I got tortillas. I got tortillas. Ria, I got like loaded, loaded tortillas. You know, like when they put the, 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 the shower cream, the jacamole, the, the tomatoes. I did all of that, yeah? You lot, why are all the ones at the bottom cold? Why are the tortillas cold? Where were the tortillas that they're... Tortillas are crisps. Why are they cold? Tortilla chips are crisps. Why are they cold? And why is there no sauce on the ones on the bottom? What was you doing? They gave me one spoonful of cream for a whole bowl of tortilla chips. What? Look at me. My cheeks are full. I've got really fat arms. It's obvious I like my food. Fill it up. What are you doing? And when I'm telling the woman that it was cold, she goes, Madam, no, I mean, and then you know when they touch the ball like this? I'm telling you it was cold. I am a customer. I am always right. Go and do as I say. Take it back. I don't want it. My thing is, is that I'm always really polite when it's like, when it's not someone's issue. But, but, when I'm telling you that something's happened, yeah, in the nicest way possible, because I'm trying to hold my tongue, I'm holding my tongue, and you're telling me no, it makes me want to jump over the table and eat you, because I'm hungry. Do you understand? So sort it out. Sort it out. Frank and Benny's fuckles are, writ are written off. Finished. Not only are they long, you have to wait to go on a table. So you made me, you made me wait 30 minutes to eat sand. You lot, I'm, I'm going, okay? I've got to go pick up the kids. Bye. Okay, I'm reloading.